panoramic tour of London. So I'll be telling you about the history of London and then of course we'll be pointing out the sites and we're going to stop a couple of times in the important places to go for a stroll. Everybody, Meran and Peter, welcome or welcome to London. Okay? Our tour will be in English, but maybe a few words of Gujarati Hindi might creep in from time to time. You never know. And it was founded by the Romans in 2000 years ago. So they came here in 43 AD. So when they came here, there was nothing, just river for catching fish, eating for food. Trees were there for making buildings and so on. And they built a city which became the largest city, Roman city, north of the Alps. 10,000 people. They stayed for end of Roman Empire. Then we had Saxons and Vikings and Danish invasions. And in 1066, the biggest invasion of all, of all the time in England, never before and never since, the invasion of William the Conqueror, the Duke of Normandy, who came here because he was a cousin of the previous king who died without having any kids. There's another story, we may talk about it later. So, uh, links up, I think. So, he built, when he came to London, the Tower of London, and we're going to see that during the course of our visit this afternoon. And I'll be telling you more about that when we get there. So this is just as like a, an overview of the history of London, so you put everything into perspective as we go. Then, London until 1666, and in 1666 there was the Great Fire of London. 80% of the city burned down. I don't know if you can imagine a city burning, 80%. Nearly everybody lost their homes, shops, offices, what have you. And it was mainly rebuilt by Sir Christopher Wren, and the crowning glory of his work was St. Paul's Cathedral. And that's the first place of note that we're going to be driving past this afternoon. After that, London expanded and prospered. Nine and a half million. Today, it's seven and a half million, but nine and a half million, 1939. Now, what happened? Well, Second World War happened, and in the Second World War, 60% of the city of London was destroyed, and they didn't rebuild it all. A lot of people